Hey there, you filthy animals. Mr. Dirty back for another episode of the DTM Show. Today, once again, another one of those hot dogs from Diner Dogs, Inc. in Lake Park, Florida. This time around, it's going to be the Barbecue Bowser. And this one comes with jalapenos, fried onion strings, cheddar cheese, barbecue sauce, and sour cream. I did have them leave the jalapenos off because I particularly can't have the seeds. So I'm not going to meticulously pick each and every little seed out. And um, what's nice, they, he actually um, texted me, the owner of Diner Dogs Inc. as I got 10 minutes away, I'm already getting on the uh, freeway to head back here to Wellington, Florida from Lake Park, Florida. I get a text saying, hey, we might have forgot to put the sour cream on the Bowser. Now that's nice. You know, not many places would do that. Um, all these apps and everything that they have out nowadays for most of the fast food chains, no one's going to call and say, hey, we think we might have put your order up. Never. And they have the technology to do it. They just don't. They wait for you to bitch, and then they'll give you a, an 800 customer service number, something like that. And that goes nowhere, basically. Yeah. They were nice enough to uh, give me the heads up, and if it's not on here, well, I got sour cream here. We got a state-of-the-art kitchen downstairs, and uh, we'll hook it up. Let's crack it open and check out our barbecue Bowser. And whoa, whoa, right off the bat, wow, messy. I'll give it that. Take a look at this, guys. Here's your uh, barbecue Bowser, and there it is on the pita. You see lots of barbecue sauce. You see the hot dog going on. Uh, what else we got? You can tilt it like this. Tons of those uh, French fry straws, strings. Crispy fried onions, whatever. Tons of those on there too. Sweet. And yeah, they did forget to put the sour cream on there. So we'll go ahead and we'll add that right now. All right, so here we go. And I don't think it would have been smeared on the bread. I think maybe they might have done like a drizzle, something like that. It's probably how it would have been done. By the way, this is a new squeezable sour cream from uh, Target. Check that out also. I am. Alright, here we go. The uh, Barbecue Bowser from Diner Dogs, Inc. Here we go. Wow. The first flavor you get hit with is the barbecue sauce. And it's like a um, slightly smoky but more sweet barbecue sauce. Tangy and sweet. Um, uh, I say the smokiness is kind of like a hint in the background, but mostly uh, sweet. Kind of reminds me of a uh, Sweet Baby Ray's. If you had Sweet Baby Ray's barbecue sauce, this <laughs> it might even be it. Who knows? Uh, the sour cream. I put a lot of it on there. Can't really taste that. Um, what I do taste, though, is like an aftertaste is the French fried onion straw strings things. Those are like you get those second. You get the barbecue bam. Then you get those onions, and then you do get finally a faint hints of like the beef hot dog going on. But yeah, the sour cream just seems to get lost. I also can't taste the cheddar cheese that's on there. I'm going to take another snap into it, see if I can pick up on any of that stuff. Here we go. Okay, that time I tasted the sour cream, but still the, uh, the cheese is getting lost in translation here. Just not tasting the cheese whatsoever. Overall though, this is still a pretty kick-ass hot dog. With a lot going on. A lot of flavor profiles to deal with here. So if one of them gets lost, hey, hmm. if anything though, the cheese is there, I can see it working as a glue to hold most of this together. Can't say I like this as much as the uh, Retro Ranch Dog that we saw in a previous episode, but this is still damn good. You know, I think it's once again $7 price point on this. Comes on the uh, buttered Euro pita flatbread. Man, would I buy this again? Definitely. But I don't like it as much as the other one that I had, but it's still up there. So I'm going to give this like the highest four I could give something before going into five range. This is still pretty much the cat's ass of hot dogs. If anybody wondering about why I eat these onions and not the other onions, this is about the only way for me to eat onions is if they're fried or burnt to a crisp. Uh, if there's any kind of rawness to them, I won't go near them. So when it comes to french fried onions, 
uh, like battered onion rings of that nature, that's fair game. So there you have it, the Barbecue Bowser from Diner Dogs Inc, Lake Park, Florida. Give it a try. I'm Mr. Dirty, this is the GTM Show. You can follow me on Twitter and Instagram at the Real Mr. Dirty. And as always, get out of here. Go have a rotten day.